Tonight, lawmakers are reacting to the statewide rolling blackouts. Some worried about how the state will handle the situation. Fox 43 News Capitol Bureau reporter Rebecca Chung explains their concerns. Hundreds of thousands of Kansans have had their power shut off with little notice. And I spoke with lawmakers who are unsure of what the next steps will be to prevent this from happening again. Freezing temperatures are driving up energy use statewide and forcing power outages for thousands of Kansans. Rolling power outages are one way to conserve some energy so that we can continue to meet demand. The Kansas Corporation Commission is planning to investigate the situation after the state gets through the energy crisis to see if other factors are at play. We'll be looking at, at the entire situation and reviewing it in great detail. Now, Kansas lawmakers are weighing in on the issue, looking into what can be done to better prepare for the future. It affected so many people and I'm sure they're going to do a critique afterward. This is a very unusual situation. I'm talking to all the different people to see you know, where are the problems? Is, is there anything we can do? But lawmakers are still unsure of what exactly can be done to make sure this doesn't happen again. All of us are going to be looking at why this happened and what if anything we can do the next time it happens. Overtime and high energy costs do come into play, but Evergy says it will be working with regulators to spread those payments out over several bills. Right now, the focus is on keeping the power on for as many people as possible. At the Capitol, I'm Rebecca Chung.